Well, gray skies, gusty and chilly looking at Easton's Beach in uh, Newport right now. The look of precipitation, but the air is dry. I mean, other than a, a few sprinkles, we're not expecting much. So plans to be out, obviously bundle up, but uh, you don't need the umbrella. Wind gusts, of course, have been a factor today. Anywhere from 35, 40 miles per hour out of the northwest. It's all due to the storm from last night. It is well offshore by a couple hundred miles, but it's still uh, throwing back some gusty breezes. Temperatures cooler than average should be around 50 this time of year, and we'll actually get closer to that tomorrow afternoon, but upper 30s to about 41 in Providence, 43 in New Bedford. You can almost subtract 10 degrees with a bit of a wind chill, that breeze making it feel cooler. We've been going back and forth between clouds and sun, but you can clearly see the storm center spiraling now well offshore by about 200 miles. I'll show you a high resolution satellite photo and you can clearly see the swirl. It almost looks like a, like a tropical storm or a hurricane with a, a bit of an eye. We're getting reports, you know, the weather buoys out here of waves of 25, 30 feet. Of course, this produced massive amounts of snow in the Berkshires of Massachusetts and Northern Connecticut. One, two, Two, even three feet of snow and on the back side of it we're still feeling the wind it'll ease a little bit this evening and overnight but it'll be a little breezy tomorrow morning but not as windy as what we had today so let's widen out the view and see where our next weather system is coming from and we'll take this into the future and watch the time bar uh, we're pretty quiet for tonight and here we are tomorrow with a good deal of sunshine Thursday's a nice day uh, temperatures upper 40s to lower 50s uh, still a bit breezy but not as windy as today watching moisture across the Great Lakes in the Midwest when we jump ahead Head to St. Patrick's Day Friday. Uh, clouds on the increase, but better part of the daylight hours actually dry. We're bringing some showers by rain showers, not snow by Friday evening, Friday night. But if you have plans to be out Friday night, not, we're not looking at a stormy day. This is just it's kind of nuisance stuff and nothing more than that. Now, watching Saturday closely, but the game plan here, this is Saturday 8 a.m., is to start with some rain early, especially along the coastline, and then push that offshore with increasing sunshine uh, during the afternoon. So we'll backtrack to this evening, windy and chilly. Clouds that we have right now will gradually melt away by 11 o'clock, the temperature at around 33. A bit of, of some wind tomorrow but not as windy as today. Waking up to sunshine 7 a.m. at around 30 by 11 o'clock in the morning. We're at 42 and looking good for tomorrow. Sunshine, uh, some fair weather clouds increasing mid to late afternoon, but it's dry. You can see right there our precipitation chance is zero. Should be around 50 this time of year, and that's pretty much where we are by around 3, 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Bay forecast, bit of a breeze in the morning, so we'll keep a small crap advisory. Northwest 10 to 15, gusting to 25 in the morning. Uh, visibility unlimited. Water temperatures uh, this time of year in the uh, lower 40s. All right, seven-day forecast looking at you know, just a slight chance of a sprinkle this evening, but basically dry. Not bad for Thursday. Sunshine, breezy. Temperatures closer to average. St. Patrick's Day Friday, increasing clouds dry during the day. Just light rain showers at night. Not a big deal. Some early morning rain on Saturday dries out in the afternoon up to 50. Bright cooler on Sunday, but a decent day. Temps upper 30s to uh, lower 40s. Wind still a factor this evening as far as comfort being outdoors this evening, but otherwise dry. Yeah, comfort for sure because it is rough out there. Even in Amanda's uh, shot from Middletown, you could hear on a microphone that wind just howling. Yeah, it's still close to 35, 40 miles per hour. All right, Tony, thank you.